When using a dial caliper, it is first important to know how to read the scale and the dial. For this measurement, turn the adjustment screw to close the jaws together. Then set the dial to zero and lock the dial lock screw. Once the jaws are closed and the dial is set, the caliper can be adjusted to fit the length of the dimension being measured. When contact has been made with the appropriate touch feel, lock the top screw in place and take the reading. On the steel scale of this dial caliper, the distance between each increment is one millimeter. In this example, the inside edge of the right jaw lines up just past the 100 increment on the steel scale. As the dial did not make a full rotation back to zero, 100 millimeters will be the value taken. The next scale to be read is the dial. The distance between each increment on this dial is 10 microns. For this final value, the end point of the needle directly lines up with the 72nd increment, which is 720 microns. This value will then be added to the total value. The total measurement value for this length on this part is 100 millimeters and 720 microns.